Yeah. Right. Okay, the new VM7 is installed here. Click on the icon. It's set up as a thick client. As you can see, it's taken quite a while to come up. We'll just open the manufacturing window. Oh, I gotta wait for it to come up. I'm starting to type ahead of time because I'm I'm used to VM6, which was quicker than this for whatever reason. Zero seven nine oh six one. So I open up a bill of materials. You can see it's taking a long time to load. Again, significantly longer than VM6. So when I go in and add a part, open up a search. It takes quite a while to open up and load, and you can see it's working on it. <clears throat> the queries for parts are quick, so the part comes up quick. But if I want to drag and move this window, I'm still holding my mouse down, and the window's got to catch up to that, and now I let go of it. If I want to change the size of this window, I get to where I'm going and I'm waiting, I'm holding my mouse button down right now. You can see the seconds passing. I'll release now that the corner's gotten there. And, and now it's jumping and resizing to something else, why I don't know. I'll bring this part in. Okay. So, same thing. This window, you saw it moved a bit quicker. Okay. And now, what I find most strange is, I'll go to my email application, I'll go to Internet Explorer, I'll go back, and any Windows application I flip to from that I've ever used in my life, it's really the speed of the computer and the screen redraw. But, when I come back to here, that came up fairly quickly. I'll bring this parts window up again. I'll search that same part. Get that window up on my computer. And again, I'll go to my email. I'll go to Explorer. I'll go back to my email. And now you can see just the problem it's having with bringing this window forward, which should already be loaded within the graphics card buffer. So something fishing is going on. And uh, like I say, way slower than VM6 and to the point where we're losing a lot of time over it. Okay, really appreciate it. Thanks.